वेलकम टू द प्राइड डेमोस्ट्रेशन ऑफ डुअल एक्सिस सोलर ट्रैकिंग सिस्टम यूजिंग एम पी पी टी आलग्रिथम इन दिस पॉइंट वी आर यूजिंग वन सोलर पैनल सो हियर वी कैन सी एंड ऑल्सो वी आर यूजिंग ए फोर एल डी आर्स सो हियर वी कैन सी फोर एल डी आर्स एंड ऑल्सो यूजिंग ए चार्जिंग सर्क्यू एंड वोटे सेंसर सो दिस द दिस बैटरी वोटे सेंसर एंड अनदर इज अोलर वोटे सेंसर सो दिस इज अ सोलर वोटे सेंसर एंड सो वी कैन सी क्लियरली हियर सो दिस इज द सोलर वोटे सेंसर एंड दिस इज द बैटरी वोटे सेंसर एंड दिस इज द बक कन्वर्टर एल एम थ्री फाइव नाइन सिक्स एंड ऑल्सो यूजिंग ए मास्टर्ड बोर्ड एंड एट टू नाइन थ्री डी मोटर ड्राइवर एंड ऑल्सो यूजिंग ए ट्रैक पी सी बी एंड एल सी डी सिक्सटीन बाई टू एल सी डी एंड आर डी नो यूनो बोर्ड सो वी डोंट प्रोवैड दिस बैटरी सो इट इज एक्चुअल ट्वेल्व वर्ड्स टू एम बैटरी सो इन शिपिंग वी डोंट प्रोवैड दिस बैटरी इन एयरपोर्ट स्टाफ दे डोंट अलो द बैटरी सो दट्स वे यू हेव टू अडजस्ट दट बैटरीज वी डोंट प्रोवैड एनी एनी कैंड ऑफ बैटरीज फॉर द डेमो पर्पज वी आर यूजिंग ट्वेल्व वर्ड्स टू एम बैटरी यू हेव टू यूज बेटर दैन बेटर टू यूज ट्वेल्व वर्ड्स वन एम बैटरी और टू एम बैटरी सो डोंट इंक्रीज द वोल्टेज और करंट so using this clips we, here we can see i have connected positive side and i have connected this negative side uh, black color is a negative terminal and the uh, red wire is a positive terminal we need to connect that one so the main aim of this part is to uh, based on the uh, sun it will be rotate the it it will be track the sunlight so so it will be generate a trans uh, it will be generate a dc power that will be given to this charging circuit using this charging circuit we will charge this battery so here we can see the connection so this charged uh, solar generated charging will be given to this master board based on the master board we will generate a pwm signal that will be if it is a 100% pwm signal then it means it will give a 14 volts voltage to the battery so whenever the voltage solar voltage is more than uh, 14 volts then the pwm signal will be decreased which means it will provide exactly 14 volts uh, to this battery only so the main purpose of this pwm uh, signal is to give a constant 14 volts to the battery and also here we can see this is a track pcb it will equally divide the 5 volts power supply to this all components like lcd display voltage sensors and the arduino board and the mosfet board and a uh, these all things will be works on the 5 volts power supply so we are taking the 5 volts power supply using this lm2596 buck converter it will take the 12 volts input and it will be stepped down up to 5 volts of dc that 5 volts of dc will be given to this track pcb now if you want to on this one so just uh, go there and switch on this one and it will show the welcome to the point so here we can see it will be show the bi means battery current bv means so bi means battery current bv means battery voltage and si si means solar current and si sv means solar voltage due to low sunlight it will be generate a very low voltage and also here we can see after that one we will show the bp means battery power and the sp means solar power and here we can see pwm signal shows in the percentage so the system is in on position now we can see now i am providing light to the ldrs for example imagine this is a sun so now sun will be rays from here to here now we can see the light will be come to this first the solar panel so we can see with a delay of time it will be rotated and also we can see if the sun comes from here then it will be rotated like this now coming to the rotation side if i place light to here it will be rotated to the left side sorry right uh, left side and now if i provide the light to the ldr from the right of this one so it will be rotated to the right side
so in this way this point will be works so based on the sunlight tracking it will be track the sunlight using this four LDRs and now here we can see we can also use transformer to charge the battery so here we can see we have mentioned here S by T means solar or the transformer connection so now here we can see we are giving the connection of the transformer we are removing the solar and we are giving the transformer and now I am giving the uh, power supply using this power cable it takes 230 volts power supply so here we can see it, it is the taking the 230 volts power supply from the, uh, from the primary side and it will be stepped down up to 12 volts 1 amp that will be given to this rectifier rectifier or charging circuit so it will be convert AC to DC the converted DC will be given to this battery so it will convert up to 12 volts 1 amp that will be given to this battery and also now I am uh, removing this one if I place solar connection over here and also we can see there will be a small light indication now I am uh, giving some light now we are providing a light to the system so we can see there will be a small light indication so when we place this one so we can see we are providing the two phones light to the system and, we, and also we can see there will be a small light indication so when we uh, when we uh, place it in the sunlight so it will be generate more power then it will be light will be go glow very high and one doubt will be raised on our mind that so generally solar panel generate a DC power supply why we are giving to the charging circuit or a rectifier so rectifier generally converts AC to DC right but why we are giving here because this uh, uh, charging circuit will be works as a reverse voltage protector so whenever the battery voltage is more than the solar voltage then automatically reverse voltage will be come across to this solar panel then the solar panel may damaged in order to protect this solar panel we are using this charging circuit or rectifier in this rectifier we have a diodes which uh, allows only forward voltage doesn't allow the reverse voltage so that's why we are providing this rectifier between the battery and the solar panel so the for the reverse voltage protection so in this way this part will be works thanks for the watching